This is the Category 3-4 Elkridge Spring Classic Road Race in Elkridge, Maryland. The course is eight laps of a five mile loop with a short steep hill. My priority for this race was to stay safe. The wet pavement and the peloton being confined to a single lane meant that a crash was likely. My plan was to get near the front and try to go with a breakaway to reduce my chances of getting caught in an accident. I haven't talked much about my training because there isn't much to it. I've never been one to set goals or lay out a training plan because it takes the fun out of the sport for me. However, because of a schedule change, I haven't been able to train the way I prefer, which is to do group rides with people stronger than myself. So that said, I've managed to do some hard 30 second on, 30 second off intervals to get myself in shape. This seemed to help today. I was able to catch just about every attack during this race in hopes of participating in a break. The cool thing is that I felt in control and fresh despite jumping quite a few times. Even going into the climb on the final lap, I felt fresh and ready for the sprint a half mile from the top. Then after about 30 seconds of hard effort up the steeper section of climbing, my legs did what they were trained to do and turned into spaghetti. I went from feeling fresh to toast in under a minute. Doing the 30 second intervals were great for short sprints, but they did nothing for providing me the strength to put out power for the two to three minutes needed to stay with the pack until the finish. I tried to recover quickly and go again a few times, but it just didn't work. On the bright side, I accomplished my goal of staying near the front and avoiding crashes, and I learned that I need to do some two to three minute intervals and some FTP work. Doing short intervals are great for being able to catch a wheel, but they can't be used exclusively. Lesson learned. Thanks for watching.